I feel like Tokiko is involved somehow. Shikara was a member of Nice, and he knew about Bats 490. That's not all. The appearance of Jin's corpse was made to seem like a paranormal phenomenon. As if the same thing from the Philadelphia experiment had happened. After all, we are living in nothing but a simulation. A false world created by a program. Could she have done all this to give her claim credibility? I don't know, but it's possible. In any case, let's go see Tokiko. I have to talk to her. Understood. We've come this far. I'll back you up until you're satisfied. Aw. And inspect any of the things there, okay. That's fair. That's fair. <clears throat> Nice Japan branch. February 12th, Tuesday, 11.20. I've been expecting you. I thought you would be arriving soon. Nice to meet you again. How fucking dare you. Wait, what do you mean Zack tried to cheat to speak to her directly again? No. In, oh. the, in the function of Tokiko trying, asking if we were a frayer, Zack tried to bullshit his way through oh, the that's right. password. Yeah. Which is, which IMO cheating. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, I didn't know where it was going to lead. Well, I know you know, don't know where it's going to lead, and I understand the philosophy behind it, but it's like, he's the, the world of the Uchikoshi usually makes is so specific that stumbling upon the answer seems nigh impossible. Yeah. Did you say nigh impossible? Nigh is impossible. What do you mean? I anyway. Mean pancreas. I think Ryuki combated that perfectly. What do you mean, Rogue? I don't understand it. Yeah. <laughs> Her hair, I gotta say. Mm hmm. I mean, I knew you would come see me. Tokiko has, has, has a kind of hair that uh, Leaf would be attracted to. I'm yeah. Concerned. Yeah. <laughs> He's purple. Of course, Leaf likes that. Well, not not the color, just the style. Yeah. She's sleek. It's the polar opposite of my hair. And oh, it's, yeah. It's very sim similar to Dimmit Dilk hair, just purple. <laughs> no. 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 The symbol of knives. I mean, the Nanyapal X. If you if you fuse two characters, yes. There are four unseen X's hidden within. There are more than that. Yeah, I'm sorry, ma'am. Are you stupid? <laughs> they represent the truth of the world you live in. There's, There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine X's. That is yet another meaning inside the Nanyapal X. What are the hidden X's then? I'm confused. Nanyapal? Hmm. I don't know. And Chisel says that the hidden ones are made by the empty spaces between the lines. But those would be plus signs. No, I see it. I get it. Okay. 
Is there you're having to use the blank space on the uh, edge as well. Oh okay. wait. Yeah. I thought that she was just being fucking weird and I was like, um No, I think okay. I, I think it's it. What is a plus sign but a rotated X? <laughs> well I, I can't see it clearly, but it looks like there's like uh little black lines in between each X. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. If you match up the black lines and the way they go, they make more X's. Gotcha. I don't see any black X's, but let me blow this up. Oh, I see what you mean. The the they're de like the delineation pieces. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. Excuse me. There's a strange statue. There's a strange ball. There's a glass doll here. Mm hmm. It's a very well made office desk. Probably made out of mahogany. <laughs> Knew where it was going immediately. Why is it called a houseplant if it's in an office? Good question. She brought it from home. It's Memoryu. Tokiko's secretary and bodyguard. I'm can sorry, you can you try one? that again? Yeah, that's... Mamor Mamoru? Mamoru? Mamoru. Tuxedo mask! Sorry, Mamoru. Mamoru, that's the weirdest way to have pronounced that I could possibly <laughs> think of. Mamoru. That, that, that is exactly how my mom would have said it, though. Mamoru. Mamoru. Yes. It wasn't even Mamoru. <laughs> it wasn't even Mamoru. No, it was more more that. you. Yeah. That's how she would say it. Uh, look. That's the that's the look. Illinoisan kind of fucking breaking up of the sounds. That's like saying Illinois. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Illinois. No. Arkansas. Arkansas. Illinois. Arkansas. Arkansas. Kansas. America explain. <laughs> um, <clears throat> Anything suspicious about Tokiko? Not really. She's a kind woman. But I obviously wouldn't tell no. you even if I did know something. As her secretary, it's part of my job to protect her secrets. Very fair. Mm. Louisville. Mamaru is an excellent employee who faithfully fulfills his duties. I have complete trust in him. I'm honored to hear that. Ma'am is- I'm glad he got a nice employer. I respect you from the bottom of my heart as well. Aww. Gag. Shut up, Tama. Mm. <laughs> oh, like Tokyo found herself a man slave. Uh <laughs> Listen, he's a man who's got ten children. He needs this job. Why the sunglasses? These aren't sunglasses. It's a fairy's black bra. What? <laughs> well, <laughs> what a degenerate. You've been, you've been hanging out too much with Dante. <laughs> I'm putting that into your clips channel. I'm just, I took a picture of it. That's, I... What the fuck kind of writing, Uchikoshi? Ugh. <sighs> Why can't I find your clips channel? There it is. I'm the I'm sad list. no one uh, clipped Memoryu, so we can have Memoryu and Moana. Moana. Memoryu. Disney Vault is Moana. Memoryu, you know Sailor Moon's boyfriend. <laughs> Memoryu. Usagi. 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 That's exactly how I girl, said it when I was younger. Girl, you soggy. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. That one was good. Fucking. Uh, girl, you wet as bread because you suck. <laughs> okay, no, Marco, we really do need that. We, we, we really do need the memorial. Uh, it's just like the uh, thick duck ceiling fan. Oh. Uh, uh, Highly necessary. Oh. So about this room. This room. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you guys said that in the president's office at the Nice Japan branch. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
The world is full of rubbish. Know. Okay, calm down, Tokiko. Yeah, like I said, tell me something I don't know. Such things should all be washed away. That was my thinking when I designed this room. You designed it? Don't wait for the news. Yes. Well, if you wanted the news, you should be watching, like, CNN or something, not no, this game. No, 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 you know what I mean. <laughs> the flow of water cleanses so one's bad. heart. I just think this like room would just make you time. have to pee. What was that, Moon? I think this room would just make you have to pee. Yeah. It's Tokiko Shigure, president of Nice Japan. Good job. Jin's right half didn't teleport. I've solved the mystery, Miss Shigure. Jin's right half didn't teleport. It was just made to seem that way. It should have been obvious when you think about it. Teleportation? It's impossible. We live is in a it? simulation? I'm hearing this Uchikoshi is a fake world created by a program? You're hearing what? I hear Uchikoshi knocking on the door with the, Hey, guess what? It's real. <laughs> Impossible. Simulation theory is nothing but occult nonsense. Just a ludicrous oh myth like UFOs, ghosts, and Kappa. I'm sorry. We, now, we Kappa or real? We yeah, met a Kappa we... last game. Yeah, and a mermaid. I'm Anna sure Mermaid. there are people who well, like Mermaid. to believe in these things. Their names are Konami Date. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And there are groups who profit by making people believe. What is she selling? Mr. Ryuki, it appears as though there's been some misunderstanding. Oh. We of oh. Nyes have nothing to do with this. Are you sure about that? Wow, his eyes are blank. That's scary. Wait a minute. He's in disbelief. Yeah, I don't like that. What's going on there, buddy? Hold up. I'm sorry. Hold up. You ain't got no pupils up in this bitch. That's All the pieces would fit together if Nyes is the one that made the QR video. And now his pupils are back. I hope that was just like a glitch. Maybe. The only other time I saw that was after the uh, the weird possession bullshit with the QR code video. Yeah, that's mm. right. Maybe he's being possessed right now. The falsified paranormal phenomenon. What was written on the signboard. It all advances your agenda. Could it be that you wanted to spread the QR video by showing that sign along with the corpse on stream? As I've told you, we are not the ones who made the QR video. Actually, what is the purpose inside. of the QR video in the first place? Are you saying there is some message urging people to join Nyes in it? Could be. About Shikara's murder. I know of the incident, of course. However... Yes. Oh. I know you have an alibi. We were here, having a conversation during the time of Chikara Horidori's death. But that doesn't necessarily mean you're completely innocent. Oh. I keep yawning. You need it's soda. I'm drinking soda. You need water. You are the president. I'm drinking nice. water. Surely you have plenty of subordinates who can do your bidding. Are you implying I ordered someone to kill him? Exactly, Weaver. I need yep. spoons. Spoons? Energy. Mm. Spoon theory. It's a possibility. And what would be my motive? Um, well... Remember what Tokiko said. Chikara Horidori is an avid believer in the Order of Percent. 
Their order and knives are heading completely different directions. Perhaps Nyes and the Order of Percent are hostile. I see. You're suggesting there was a conflict between organizations. It is true that Nyes and the Order of Percent have differing beliefs. However, we are not at odds with one another. I really like her lip. Yeah, she's really pretty. They're really well formed. Both organizations believe in the simulation theory. In that respect, we are comrades. What do Nyes and the Order of the Sun believe in? We are living in a simulation, a false world. And from this There's false world, point. we seek emancipation. That is what Nyes believes. On the other hand, the Order of Percent we are living in a simulation, a false world. But they wish to remain imprisoned within it forever. Forever? Mr. Ryuki, have you ever played an open world game where you play as a criminal? Oh, you mean Skyrim? <laughs> you mean GTA? You mean Saints Row 3? <laughs> a game that lets you rob, murder, blow things up, leave a trail of debris wherever you go. GTA. An absurd, heinous game where you can freely commit all sorts of horrible crimes. I've never played anything like that, but I know what you mean. Then you can understand. I think I'm yawning because it's warm in my room, so I'm not getting as much air as I should be. Mm. Because the air is stagnant and warm. Yeah. If this is a false world created by someone, then the Order of Percent believe they can do whatever they wish. To mm. them, this place is a true is utopia. A dream world where they're allowed to do anything they want with no real consequences. This is why Chikara was doing genetic experimentation. Mm-hmm. That's why they want to live here forever? Exactly. I get it. That's why Jikara was researching immortality. In theory, using Purge, even immortality is achievable. The ultimate dream that humanity has been yearning for for thousands of years. It will soon become a reality. Right? Why is the humidity rising? Maybe because we're gonna get rain soon. What do you oh, think? So. Isn't that wonderful? We're supposed to be getting rain, I think, on Tuesday or something? Nice. What ability might be useful against old men? Straight lead, a finger jab, a somersault kick, a Schmidt-style backbreaker. Backbreaker. Call an ambulance! Call an ambulance! But not for me. It's a Jeet Kun Kune Do thing. Maybe. Backbreaking move, E. What's a movie? I don't know. What is a movie? I don't know. Last Torn. He seems to know all about them. About Shikaru's search for immortality. I am aware that Chikara was very particular about immortality. However, I will say one thing. One must not believe in eternal youth. Eternal youth is a lie. By the way, Mr. Ryuki, do you remember what you said earlier? Yeah. Simulation theory is nothing but occult nonsense. I'm about to put you in this fountain. That is clearly false. The simulation theory is not occult. It falls within the realm of science. In fact, many esteemed scientists have given serious thought to the matter. 
The theory was originally proposed by a Swedish philosopher. However, the concept has been around since long ago, even as far back as the days of Plato and Zhuang Se. This world may be an illusion. At least, there is no way to prove it isn't an illusion. There are great people throughout history who have held such ideas. But there's no way to prove it is an illusion either, is there? No, there is plenty of science to support it. The holographic principle, theory of relativity. The measurement problem in quantum theory can also be considered proof. Schrodinger's cat. I love my culture and f philosophy is in science, lady. Mm -hmm. And then Weaver comes in with the pile driver. For this exercise, we're pretending words don't mean what they think they mean. Mm -hmm. Interesting, it can check everything again. I think it just incidentally refreshed because it went into that zone. Or unseen X's. Oh, there is new thing here. Oh. Or unseen X's. And now it disappears. Damn, we can't ask about Chinpei anymore. <laughs> Clearly um. it wasn't going to be relevant. This is mm. 999. Yeah. <laughs> uh... The Swedish philosopher claim. I'd like to ask you one thing. Okay. Beings that are far more intelligent and advanced than we humans. Do you believe a civilization of such beings exists anywhere in this world? And by this world, I mean all possible worlds in the entire universe including those outside of our own. Well, somewhere out there, probably. I agree. Taking that into consideration, we're left with three possibilities. One. Civilization hasn't reached a level of technology advanced enough to create a simulation that can't be distinguished from reality. Two. Civilization has reached a level of technology advanced enough to accomplish this, but it hasn't for some reason. Three. Civilization has reached that level of technology and has no strong reason not to use it. Therefore, they've proceeded with creating an intricate simulation. Which of these do you think is most likely? Are you saying it's three? That is what a famous Swedish philosopher believed, at least. He further explains, that civilization must have run simulations millions or even trillions of times. In which case, it would make sense to believe our world would be included in one of those simulations. You're saying it's far more likely that we're one of the countless simulated worlds, rather than a world that exists in the one and only reality. Do I have that right? Yes. <laughs> The holographic principle? Additionally, oh, sorry, the through. simulation in the real world may be a simulation itself. Kind of like a Matryoshka doll. Just so you know, I'm not saying I believe the simulation theory. The simulation theory isn't too credible because of this Matryoshka, Ma Matryoshka aspect. Ooh, Russian nesting doll. Yes. So, holographic I'm principle? Uh, yeah, holographic principle. Even light cannot escape a black hole. 
I'm sure you've heard this before. Information is the same. It cannot escape a black hole. It's known that the amount of information trapped in this way is not derived from the volume of the black hole, but the surface area. Considering this, you can conclude that information in a three-dimensional space is stored in the boundary of its two-dimensional surface. Oh god. In other words, all information stored in this universe is encoded in a single flat plane. Just That's like a, a hologram. Regarding gravity and other physical processes, they can be completely accounted for through the laws of physics defined by the boundary surface. Let's take a character from an action game, for example. When that character falls, you may think he was mm. pulled to the ground by gravity. Thinking about it. However, gravity does not actually exist in the game world. Only code that was written in the program. The character's body is merely made to show as if it fell based on its code. You think this world is the same? The holographic principle is not a theory. It is a principle. It has already been mathematically proven. But has it been peer-reviewed? Hmm. I'm getting sleepy. I see. Then let us leave it at that. Ah, uh, I see. In any case, well, it's like, uh, there's no denying that the simulation theory is true. So you've lost your chance to ask any other questions. Yeah. Which I had a feeling that was going to happen. Yeah, but I, I think with the it what well, those options are just like in cases like a second playthrough something it's like just don't want to listen to the stuff again yep and Maybe. you chose it so we can't okay. go back <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll be back here eventually maybe but unlike probably Chikara, not i have no interest in the concept of immortality because my objective is to tear at the seams of this world and emancipate us all so you mean dying? No. Death and emancipation are completely different. I have no desire to commit suicide. Though I would be fine with dying at any time. <clears throat> because this world isn't real. There is that, yes. However, there is another reason. If I wish to do so, I can resurrect myself. Are you a fucking shifter? We are living in a false world created by a program. Therefore, if we can rewrite its code, we can create miracles. Like reincarnation, or even... Oh, that's a face. Hold up. One sec. I'm getting screenshot! You get a screenshot too, because your quality is probably better. Ooh, Pog Champ! Ooh, ooh Pog Champ! Ooh, ooh, Pog Champ! Wacky times. Scary times. I was spaced out for a minute there, but that brought me back. That brought me back. Are we done? Yeah. Yes. Bringing someone who has already passed back to life. Madam, please control your face. Has this woman lost it? 
Is she about to fucking kill Mama? Don't. Don't. Ryuki, you were right. There's clearly a lot of reasons to be suspicious of Tokiko. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's check with Wingsync. Yes. It's Mama Road. <laughs> Tokiko's <laughs> secretary and bodyguard. An absolute perfect wearing of black bra on his face. <laughs> Hold up. What? What's up? Uh, uh, look at the... Does the statue say anything? It's been shattered to pieces. Okay. And the, the nice black again. Okay, that hasn't changed. Wink sink. I saw everything. If you don't do as I say, I'm sure you know where this is going. What? What is this? Looks like Tokiko is blackmailing someone. What is it she saw? I don't know. This is as far as we can get through Wink Sink. Then... Yes, let's get a deeper look into her mind. Using a regular sink. I don't know We're gonna go into it. Get her to come in for any kind of questioning. Abyss HQ, February 12th.